Hi, to fix battery draining problem on your CMF phone one, I got several tips for you. And the first one, if you notice that your phone starts logging or does not work so fast like it was before, or maybe it drains quickly, so you can start with closing all of your recently opened apps. And for that, swipe up. And here you need to close all of those apps by swiping them up like that till you can see that there is nothing to close. So we got no recent items. That way you'll free up some memory and reduce the load on the battery. Now let's open settings and here choose display. So first thing we can do is of course adjust brightness level. So you can tap here and this bar appears on top. So if your battery drains quickly, then I suggest you to simply reduce brightness by dragging the slider left. And of course you can also enable adaptive brightness. So the brightness of your display will adjust depending on the lightning around you. But I'm gonna disable it for this video. And the next thing we need to do is go in screen timeout. And as you can see, I got five minutes. So my phone won't turn off itself for about five minutes, which is a lot actually. If you often forget to turn off your phone, then I highly recommend you to set either one minute, 30 seconds, or the best option is 15 seconds. Now, of course, you can enable dark theme like that by tapping on the switcher and this will also help to fix battery drain to fast problem. Now, if you scroll a bit, you can find this HDR display, disable it because it enables peak brightness for HDR content. And also in display refresh rate, I highly recommend you to switch from high to standard so which is 60 hertz you won't notice big difference but it will help you to get longer battery life of course let's move on to the next thing for which we need to find this google tab now from recommended switch to all services and here simply find this devices tab and in devices, you should disable to scan for nearby devices because it will constantly scan for nearby devices and drain your battery. So we don't need this, right? And after that, we can choose security and privacy. Scroll down and choose more security and privacy settings. Now, after that, you should see this tab usage and diagnostics. And here, disable this one as well because we don't need it actually, but it drains battery a lot. Now, the next thing we can do is go in connected devices, choose connection preferences. Here, find printing and make sure to disable this one as well to use print service because when it's enabled, as you can see, it is constantly searching for printers. I bet you don't need printers all the time, so disable this one and you'll notice the difference. Now the next thing we need to find here is location, of course. So in location, choose location services and then find Wi-Fi scanning and Bluetooth scanning. So in Wi-Fi scanning, make sure to disable it as well as Bluetooth scanning. As you can see, it allows apps and services to scan for nearby devices at any time, even when Bluetooth or Wi-Fi is off. But we don't need this actually, so let's disable. And of course, when you don't need to use location, disable it as well because it really drains battery a lot. This is the most significant switcher here, so make sure to disable this one as well. And now let's find this battery tab. And here you can actually enable battery saver when you got low battery percentage, for example, 20%, you can enable to use battery saver. It will automatically enable dark theme. And also this icon would be orange now. 
and it will turn off at 90% but if you are planning to charge your phone then manually turn it off because you must know that you don't need to enable use battery receiver function when charging phone because it's really big load on processor and on battery itself. And of course in network and internet when you are using your mobile data for example, so mobile data is enabled, then disable Wi-Fi and reverse. If you are using Wi-Fi like in my case, Make sure to go in sims and disable mobile data because you don't need them both at the moment. Just choose once and that's actually it. So that's all for today. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe, like and comment. And I wish you all the best. Bye bye.